SEGA In your wickedness, you have broken the ancient commandments and crafted a bond with one of the light. Our laws are clear. They demand you be eternally imprisoned. As for the impure child, she must be kept from the path of the dark arts forever. Hey guys, what's going on? My name is DBZ Fandom, and welcome to a stream of Bayonetta. Um, Bayonetta is like Devil May Cry, if you know what Devil May Cry is. It's like a female version of Devil May Cry, and it's been one that I've been most interested, interested in. So, if anything, it's about time I shows you how cool this game can be. So, let's go. Warning you, there will there will be some unexpected scenes in this game, so fair warning. I'm gonna be playing it on normal just because normal is what I usually do. existed two there we go. European clans who served as overseers of history for the powers that be. The Umbra Luches, dwellers of the darkness, and the Lumen Sages, controllers of the light. The clans paid each other great respect, and their efforts to maintain the balance between them defended the just passage of time. Yet one day, that balance was toppled. I'm seeing is like the bottom of your legs whenever I'm muted. I think of this the once like harmonious clan was fell into disagreement and stoked the flames of hatred against each other, resulting in an era of strife. The conflict between the Umbra and the Lumen threw all of Europe into a chaotic loop of battle, ambush, assassination, and casualty. It was truly a gruesome war. Despite the tremendous radiance of God shining upon them, the Lumen Sages were gradually weakened by the assault of the secretive Dark Witches. Years after the balance was lost, the war had ended in the Umbra Witches' favor.
So this is before she got um, banished into that lake. If those of you who don't know what I'm talking about, you'll figure it out soon. I like how they do it in this old um, video style. It looks nice. Looks like you're watching a old times video thing. What in the world are, you, are these the Lumen Sages? What in the what in the world? Okay, that's her, I guess. Um, what are you guys doing? It's like some sort of big ceremony. Oh, oh dear. What are you guys doing? normal? This isn't humane. Well, how can you get even more humane than this, right? <laughs> so, I guess, let's go. Graves, it shows exactly who did this, which is awesome. I like the detail going into that. Hideki Kamiya. Hey! Don't be doing that all over Hideki Kamiya's grave. That's not nice. It, it looks right. like Humpty Dumpty's taking his last fall. Even Oleg Man the Destroyer gets scrambled in the end, right? You know, I still don't get why the hell you drag me out here for these things. I just drop off the merchandise. Hey, bet you can't guess what today is. Reading the good Lord's book ain't gonna do much. People been waiting for this asshole to get whacked for ages. Please. Now, look around. There's no love lost for old Humpty Dumpty. But you gotta keep the outfit happy. We don't take care of him, they take care of us. Pretty much, yep. I prefer my shoes made out of rubber, not concrete. I agree hey, with that. It's that kind of town. Without good-hearted souls like us to put these bastards six feet under, where'd society be? Of course, the pay's not bad either. Jesus, you really get into this shit, don't you? If it were me, I'd be praying he ends up barbecue. Or at least sunny side up. <laughs> you can keep praying, but the only way this guy's meeting the Lord is if God's hungry for breakfast. <laughs> I don't believe that's true. He'll judge anybody and everybody in his court. And I'll give the, them a fair judgment. Speaking of hungry, we done here. My kids are baking me a birthday cake tonight. Cute little fuckers, I tell you what. I agree. Well then, I don't, I haven't, we haven't adios. seen them at all, but, you know. Hey, don't be doing that to him. That's not right. Give them some respect. What the fuck? 
Tegye? Krisztus meg! Ah! I hate this damn light! I can't see a thing! Ah! Oh, what the there? Ain't they? You hearing me? You you can see them, can't you? I see them. They are instruments of God, descending upon his heavenly rays to earth. Oh my god! Dear Lord, grant us guidance and keep safe the souls of our loved ones for all eternity. Don't drop his book. That's not right. But this isn't about being right, it's about kicking some angel's butt. <laughs> Even though I don't want to say it because I am of this faith, it's a pretty good game nonetheless. And so we are fighting the affinity angels. So let's kick their butts right now. <laughs> Down goes the curtain. You look tired. Let me tuck you in. Run. Yeah, you can't even Mama, see what's going on. They're all dropping like flies. <laughs> Here he comes. Next time you want me hands on you, you better make sure I'm dead. Now move out the way. If it ain't my good buddy Vinzo, how about you get out of here? You die, and I'm gonna have to go back in that hole chasing after the money you want. Oh. That wouldn't be good. Do you naughty little angels deserve a good banking? There we go. Beautiful indeed. Beautiful, but very sad and graphic at the same time. Oh, my God. There we go.
that was your last call. No more shots from me, Bayonetta. Here we go. Why is there basic attack? You want to touch me? Yeah. And then we can chain together these combos that you see. And you can easily. That's why this game is so good, is because there are so many combos in this game that you can do. It's unreal. You can two, one, and then that allows you to dodge. Alright, here we go again. Alright, and with that, <clears throat> there's a special move you can do. I tried to dodge it perfectly, so then once you dodge it perfectly, this will activate. Quit messing around. Nope. This. Alright, this will activate. Quit messing around. This. Alright, come on. I'm doing this several times. Then, this is witch time. What witch time will do is it will allow the enemies to go slower. That way they won't attack. And you can just wail on them pretty much. There we go. Perfect. Now let's do this. Then you can get new abilities for her, like, like some things like throw and butterfly and other stuff. And it will better help you, like, let's say you get damaged or something. It will, um, be easier for you to, um, uh, like, dodge or do interesting attacks as well. And the things we're collecting are halos. That's gonna be our current for later. This is a pretty good song opening, considering too. I like this version of Flying Spoon. I've listened to the original version, and it's an old song. I'm glad they remade it like this. Let's do this. <laughs> oh, my only playground. <laughs> Alright, so now we're getting into gun combos. Except you can do with your gun. Like this. If I can do it. Well, I killed one of them, but it'll show me the easier way. Yeah, that. That or that. It's showing you just how to use your gun when you fight. And so when you're swarmed like this. Yep. Yep. And then what that will do is that will get you into a targeting mode where you're able to move the stick around and fight. So you have to keep the same button health down or else it'll switch the gun from the hands to the legs. It won't do that automatically. So, you, so if you're gonna switch it, you're gonna have to wait until the combo is over. Switch. Right now I'm using her hands to shoot and before I was using her feet. 
All right, let's do this. Give me a second. Come on, don't be that sick, serious. You can get only like to a local car dealership or something and fix it. Haven't you figured it out yet? There's no quarter for you in this world. <laughs> There we go. idea how much this is gonna cost to fix? How the fuck do I always get wrapped up in this shit? I don't know. You ask me. Hmm. Engine still purrs nicely. Now, about this little thing you've been looking into for me, Enzo. Let's have a quick chat. See? This is why I told you I was going home. I just got held up in the air by some invisible things and you want an intelligence briefing it never stops with you you keep belly aching like that and you're liable to wake eggman from the dead and i don't think either of you would like that ah! catch you later bayonetta something tells me you're gonna need a rush on our special project before this shit hits the fan wait rodan sense. what about eggman such a popular chap I bet they hate him down there as much as you did when he was up here. We just need to make sure he won't come crawling back when they kick him out. Nothing a flower bed can't fix. Fill her up. You heard the man. Finish up in five minutes or you're walking home to your cake and candles. What? Don't you leave me here! Enzo, the road. Pay attention. Look 
can you be so calm? You're still getting screwed in all this, too. Of all the low-life scum in too deep in this town, I've never seen one get wrapped up in a fight with God's messengers. Jeez. He dressed like a nun, too. When you end up in the afterlife, that's not going to be pretty. I can't help it if I like the little outfits. The toys are nice. <laughs> 20 years ago, you woke up stuck in a casket at the bottom of a lake. All you can remember is that you're a witch. But now, you're stuck because you gotta sacrifice our halo-wearing friends every day or they'll drag your ass back down to hell. I know, I thought I got screwed, but being forced to slap around the divine for a living? It's really getting screwed. If I needed a biographer, you wouldn't be my first choice. I see to the funeral, you get me the information I asked for. That was our deal. Ha 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 ha, come on now! Look at my poor car! I'm working for free after this! At least let me get a drink at Rodan's before you start drilling me. The info I got is good. It's gonna get you close to finding the other stone in the pair and figuring out some of that lost past of yours. I swear. <laughs> After jewels instead of cash, just like a girl. <laughs> Jesus, can't you take a joke? Enzo. He's not the type to Someone's jump around. You a present. Like, Too bad. It's like something important stand, to me. Bugs. <laughs> huh? What the fuck? Wha what ah! is that? Oh! Nice job freezing time there. <laughs> Hey! 
Oh, darn it. I messed up. Those assholes sure know how to get attention. Even perk the ears of the hotheads down home. You don't say. It's getting harder and harder to tell the worlds apart. Human world. Inferno. Paradiso. Who can tell the difference? Even harder with Purgatorio in the middle. Fight long enough oh. in there and you'll really lose sight. Why the sudden interest in metaphysics? It's a balance, right? Even if some of them like messing around with the humans, we've all got a stake in the status quo. But people keep fucking around like this, the Book of Revelations is gonna look like Mother Goose. Heaven and Hell are gonna go straight for each other's throats. No, 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 that can't happen. Heaven and hell can tear each other to pieces for all I care. I've got my own. Don't you care about what happens? About. Something so. Sheesh. Everything is a bit too bracing. And Enzo's tip makes the timing too perfect. This reeks of a setup. Someone in one of those lost memories calling you out. I got a little present for you. These babies are special. Built from an alloy the devil himself would kill to get his hands on. Don't break these, because they're one of a kind. Ooh, those are good guns. Nice. Calling me out. I don't go in for strange offers. Then again, I'm getting a little tired of these weaklings they keep throwing at me. Maybe I should aim for something a bit more high class.
pounding them down tonight, baby. Not to butt into your affairs, but I'm pretty sure you got somewhere better to be. The guys you're up against aren't the type to wait for you to finish a round. Enzo, her drinks are going on your tab, buddy. <sighs> you did beat motherfucker. Ah! Again, done. Let's go. I don't know how many rounds of this I'm gonna do because it's all by here. So, I asked around and some whale in Europe is trying to fence a huge rock on the black market. He calls it the right eye. Saying it's part of some set called the eyes of the world. Fits the bill of what you're after, don't it? Does, now, yes. here's the funny bit. The stone passes around the halls of power for hundreds of years, vanishes, and then the black market goes white hot for the thing. But the seller wanted an arm and a leg for it, to the point no one could stomach the price. So back goes the stone, but not before everyone figures out where the guy is. <laughs> You're gonna enjoy doing this one, I bet. I love sticking it to the rich. Of course, when you do, don't forget your old buddy Enzo stuck his neck out on this one. Slide me a few fuzzles out of the rich guy's pocket for my troubles, right? Anyways, you better get going before the trail gets cold. Off to the middle of nowhere. Paradise of Europe. They grin. Welcome to 
here we go. Yeah, the humans can't see her, which is cool. You arrived at last, my dear. The time has come to awaken the eyes. Here, Mom, my dear child, such a beautiful young lady become. I have always seen to it. No harm comes to me. So, this is supposed to be paradise? I don't know what paradise is supposed to be, but this just looks like a run down part of that big walk. I don't know if that's what paradise is, but I know in the Soul Society, it kind of looks like this. There we go, just smashing up all the furniture, you don't know. I knew it! I knew there was something! Just have to keep on looking until you find it. I'm trying to, to do yet. I'm really surprised they added this. I'm surprised that they added Bayonetta to Smash as well. She's a good fighter, but I can't really play her. Which is sad. I can win like two or three matches with her, but I'd have to lose like three or four times in a row. Don't judge, okay? I'm rusty on my smash, especially with her. Alright, yep, so the door is blocked, so the only way to do it is with this. So what this is, is this is a wall that reacts to the energy that we have that has. So the thing we have to do is open it like that. And then you have to get this thing break it out from its cage. Like that. There we go. And then what this will do is this will spawn some angels. There we go. This is cool how you can just slash them down with a simple key. Come on, just a little further down. I've got him. There we go. End him. Not bad at all for a somewhat seasoned player. And yes, I will not be 100%ing this. Even though I do want to get like all the gems and everything, the main thing I want from all of this is the weapons. That's the main thing that I want. 
and you'll figure that out in a little bit. So this is a wicked weave, what a wicked weave, a part of her hair, you know like the foot and stuff that you can see me use, that's the wicked weave. There we go! So, what it's saying is we just have to activate it at the right time. Well, let me read it. Lumen Sage and Umber Witch. When their powers meet in a test of strength, the lightning released will be your test. If you wish to walk upon water, prove your, prove your mettle by dodging the lightning, lightning in a single hair's great breath. Single hair's breath, eh? go now I'm able to walk on the water here we go wait a second what happens if I fall in the water I'm just wondering will I unlock something down here there's something down here that I could use no it's just a little sub area I think a lot of people... Oh. <clears throat> um. Not bad. There we go. <clears throat> That's going to be our platform to get up. I'm not going to use it. Yeah, I'm gonna... Nope, nothing around here. Up we go. Yeah, something new to you, I know. Just destroy all the furniture, don't worry, nobody needs it to sit down or anything. I like the music in this too, it's so angelic. I don't know why, but I've always liked the angelic music, it's nice. It's nice to listen to, um, You can't do that. I knew it. This town's teeming with heaven's little helpers. It's making my buddies downstairs awfully nervous. And your point is... Some places in this world are closer to Paradiso or Inferno. The rat hole of a town you and I live in is close to both. But the Bygridians, it got a special air about them. They're closer to Paradiso than anyone should ever be. And that shit just plain creeps me out. It does, yeah. <laughs> I guess I'm gonna have to set up shop here and score me some halos. These stupid rings are worth a fortune back home. Since it seems you're spoiling for a fight, if you come across any of these, bring them to me, and I'll hook you up. <sighs> Another one looking to lie in his pockets. <laughs> I'm beginning to see why Enzo is so fond of you. Real cute. But let's get one thing straight. Your fights are yours alone. I'm only here to watch my handiwork in action. So don't get any bright ideas about coming to me for help. No. You get one thing straight. 
I'm not the slightest bit interested in the fact that you made these guns. If you get in my way, I will... How do the Americans put it? Oh, yes. Bust a ass. <laughs> right on. Right yes. on, baby. Right on. Indeed. <laughs> All right. But Rodon is a pretty good guy. He won't go our way. But yeah, he definitely won't help us. Out, I oh, and um, I know there is a cutscene. Like a very special cutscene. But I can't really tell you guys about it because. Yeah, it's. I'm not saying it's bad, I'm just saying it's one of the hardest things that you will ever do in this game. Like, hard via boss hard. Like, a secret boss that hard. Yeah. If you guys have played this game and, like, fully mastered it, you know what I'm talking about. If those of you who didn't play this game and master it, well, I'm gonna have to figure out how to do it myself and beat the game. Well, I have, like, one or two files that have beat this game, I beat the game, bomb. I could just round up some halos, maybe buy, fight some of the stronger bosses again, and then go for it. But I think <clears throat> I have to have, like, a certain weapon or something to do it. Guys, other are the applaud angels. Ooh, I like the flower petals. That is nice. Oh, <laughs> 
in the later game, we're gonna have to fight like five enemies in like in a row or whatever. Like, that is like whenever we get to like the harder. Part. There we go. Finish him off. Get out of here. <laughs> Size. Things a little too big to be carrying around, isn't it? <laughs> Even for you, it's a little big. Hmm. But how would she fight with it, to be honest? It'd have to be. You'd have to use her magic on it for something. Can I take this in there with me? Yeah, it goes with me, or it just comes off. Yeah, no, it stays on. Well, well. An Angelic Hymns Gold LP. Got your hands on something awfully rare, haven't you? That thing is the perfect bait to coax out some of Hell's ugliest. One note hits their ears, and a damn who's who of Inferno comes pouring out of the inner circles. Then I can use them to breathe life into what I make best. Weapons, Weapons of mass destruction. Tell you what, you give me that record, and I'll order up something <clears throat> so fiendish, angels will cry at the sight of it. I'll just have to pop down to the tropics for a bit. So take a load off. Just waiting for Rodan to come back with our new weapon. And I don't know if we have enough Halo for this yet. This is one of the weapons I'm definitely gonna use. All done. He's a little rude, but he makes up for it with charm. Be nice to him, okay? Oh, this isn't what I needed. These are the guns. So we're just gonna wait until we get what I need. That's gonna be my best weapon to use against this guy. Or these guys. Oh, you'll know what it is. If you know me, you know which blades I like the best. Which things I like the best. It's not guns at all. I if it's a gun game, if there's a sword, I'd write I'd honestly just use the sword over anything else, because yeah. <laughs> Who could go wrong with a sword? <laughs> Can I? Okay, I thought you. There we go. Yep, there's the attack. I thought it would do it. Yeah, it brings it all right down with it, so that's nice. Open! Pure Platinum. I, I never get like a pure Platinum, I always get just like a Platinum or something.
here we go. Yeah, get out of here. Gold, not bad. I'm getting even better. Even though I did take like one or two of those fireballs, it's not bad. should have yep I do have all my health back no I'm gonna save all my halos so now for this I have to be very careful because of that
over. Okay. Not good, but not bad either. Alright, pretty good. Start it. This is a pretty good game so far. Yeah. 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 Whoa, whoa, okay. Oh, that's just a lot of angels on her bike. Okay. Fancy bumping into you here. Out to find some answers about your past, are we? You've quite the familiar face, and using the same powers. But you'll have to forgive me. Do we know each other? <laughs> same powers? <laughs> Don't make me laugh. Your little dip in that lake has left you a bit rusty. Oh. I've been high and dry for 20 years now. The only rust on me is from the lack of any real challenge. Perhaps you're up for the task. You've already disappointed me. is a moment I've long desired. But you've forgotten your destiny and wasted the past 20 years. You're right. I do seem to be having trouble remembering things of late. Would you be so kind as to take it from the top? Two overseers, the eyes of the world. They are the power behind everything. John, as heir to the clan, the time has come for you to prove your right to fight under the Umbran name. You may select opponents of your choice. Then allow me to face the outcast. Nanon! Nilen Kiadagat! The child is of impure blood. Challenging her would be a violation of our tenets of faith. It would not be the first time we faced each other. Kiard! Will you face me in this hallowed arena? Well, if I must. But I pray you've got a little something for me in return. You know, I'm very fond of stuffed animals.
Oh, we're in a fight. We're getting these up here now. Alright, let's go. Thing is dead. Oh, <laughs> 
there we go. There we go. Onward. Yep, as the moon fades, your power fades as well. Take open the door! here together and it will never tear us apart. <laughs> wow. Sayonara. Why do you wear Fleur that cloak? De Parfum.
Such a wonderful floral bouquet. With its subtle hints of...
Rosemary? You know, in the language of flowers, Rosemary equates to remembrance. <laughs> Which doesn't quite equate to you, now does it? Bayonet! Shit! Will you stop that? That little Bargon Enzo was a nice touch. Seeing you here, I suppose it wasn't the only one. You've certainly you, haven't you, my little Cheshire puss? I'm not your pet. The name is Luca. A name you'd better remember. Oh! <laughs> You can't just run away from me like that! I know what I saw that day! I know all about your kind. Sure, my colleagues laugh at me for chasing fairy tales, amongst other things. But I know they're real. I know the truth. Same smell that clung to the air the day my father was murdered. Which means I'm right on your doorstep, Bayonetta. I'll let you in on a little secret, Cheshire. The name is Luke. You need to hone your sense of smell, my dear. There's no rosemary in the perfume. After all, rosemary is a demon repellent. Right. <laughs> Oh, 
You only run away so fast because you've got something to run from. Me! But you can't escape me forever! that bad at least so there is something you can do with these phone things that I've heard about um let me get to one of them that I remember There's one of them around It was one of these. You had to press like some sort of weird code and like a blade or something would appear for you to collect or like unlock to where you have to pay halos.